。本節目內主持人及嘉賓的言論純屬個人意見，並不代表本台立場。Merriment. Survival for expats in the concrete forest on Friday night. Bat. Hi guys, welcome back to Yukon. So with us, the weekly show, show where, where we get, get wasted. wasted. You guys missed that just during the break. I um tried to scare Cassie into thinking we'd go live to air before. I misspelled something. Now I need to correct it because I'm, I'm, people are going to think I'm retarded. So anyway, so Perry has come up with some things to do. Um, pretty much, guys. What I thought I'd love to have a little chat about is I was thinking about Bow Wow and how he is um such <laughs> he is a, a seminal he, music. Um, he's, he's he's an iconic uh, figure. He is, he is, he is. In English speaking literature. He is. Um, um, bow wow wow, yippee yo, yippee yay, where my dog's at. It's, it's poetic. It's a classic, really. it's one for the ages. It's famously poetic. Um, so, quick question, Cassie. Yes. Who do you think is the best character in TV or movies? Ever. Ever. Okay, so I know I don't ever shut up about this, but I was watching Glow. Oh no! And no. I think the best character is the guy, is this guy played by Mark Maron, who um, is the. I just love him. Like he's he's basically Tim but funnier. Oh, um, which but is great. would you say he's the best character ever? And like, I don't know. I just really loved him as like the character. He's like really grumpy and weird, and I liked him. Oh, interesting. Who do you think is the greatest character? I don't know. I was gonna say I've got to have a think about it because it. I mean, best character. It's like, I actually think best character is probably Walter White from Breaking Bad. Never seen and it. Jesse Pinkman. For those who have seen it, they're my favorite. Pretty much Jesse, I loved. I thought he had such a fantastic character arc. Like he was, he was really likable. I've got a lot of friends that did watch it and hated him, but you never know. I, 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 I read from my perception of somebody who's never watched Breaking Bad. Yeah. I think a lot of people like him. I don't know. Yeah. It's. Mm. I'd have to say it's a good show. It gets pretty dark. Um, yeah, that's why I can't watch it. Like I'm too scared of like the violent. Oh no no, it's not it's violent. It's just more. Like you know, controlling your drug arc. I I just mind like violence. Yeah. Okay. Fair. Oh, look at you look pushing at your fucking, boobies together. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, well, um, <laughs> fucking bruises. What about this? Is a character Gorgeous. that I was thinking about. Johnny Depp, Pirates of the Caribbean, Captain Jack Sparrow. First movie, so sexy. I think. I'm. I've never seen. Um, what never have seen. you watched? What the fuck is going? Well, on? I grew up. So I mentioned a couple of times on the show. I grew up without a television. Yeah, I didn't have all. a television at all, dude. Uh, but I still went to the movies. Uh, I didn't go to the movies either. It wasn't well. The only time I'd go to the movies was when I'd tell my mom I was going to the movies and really go out, and she always found out. Yeah. Every okay. single fucking time. Because we are our mothers, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Like, literally every single time I'd be like, okay, fuck it, I'm going to a movie. It starts at yeah. 11, I'll be back at one thirty. My mom's like, and where is your ticket? And she'd just question me and question uh. me and break me down until I admitted to her that I'd actually gone to Stormy's. So, mm. uh, no, but no television whatsoever. My parent, like my mom, not that my mom raised me, but my maid never took me mm. to the cinema. Okay. Um, well, what so what would you say? Because I was going to say Captain I, I, Jack Sparrow. My first Sparrow. TV, I was 19. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. I was going to say Captain Jack Sparrow. I loved him in the first movie, but then I think he just lost all his charm as he went along, and I got bored with him. Did you have a character, though, that you watched in a show where you were like, this guy's amazing, and then after a while you're kind of like, eh. Mm. Kind of like Peter Griffin in Family Guy. Um, Piece of shit. Oh, now. one of the characters in Orange is the New Black. Um, started Ooh. to bore me. I can't remember who it was, though. Piper, the lead? Oh yeah, Piper sucked always though. She always fucking sucked. Oh, for those who watch Orange is the New Black, I think you can connect with us on that mm -hmm. because Piper's just so That's why the latest seasons are really good because Piper... She's not in it. She's not in it. Anyway, next question. Do you have another question? TV oh, no, 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 I was just going to talk about... And then, you know, the fact that I found Captain Jack Sparrow really attractive because I liked kind of his carefree attitude. And then it got me thinking... You're like you know, a bad boy, Perry. Pretty much. And then it got me thinking about, you know, these... Um, what is that if, your type then? Bad boy. Yeah, I, I, I like I like good boys who are bad boys in bed. See, this is the big thing that I was going to ask you. Okay, so you know the way there's these um, you've got these traits amongst men and women. You know, women are supposed to be beautiful like this, have massive boobs, really pretty eyes, blah blah blah. What is something that you like in a boy that is not considered uh, mainstream? Oh, traditionally, tradition, that's traditionally what masculine. Or just like what other people would kind of be like, well, that's not what I'd see as an attractive thing. I like thing. body hair on guys, which is Ooh, weird. See, I'm that's like something. into body hair. 
Where do you like the body hair to be? Everywhere. Like as in not like not like the back hair. Like I don't mind a bit of back hair. I like like I don't know. It's weird because my like I feel really bad because my boyfriend doesn't have body hair. Oh. Um, but I like I like a little bit of a little bit of hair. A little bit of hair. Uh, I guess that's like that's quite a normal thing to find sexy. It's normal, but you wouldn't find like on a dating site girls are like, like must yes, have must have back hair. Yeah, must um, be hair. Back hair is kind of scary. That's what I find. Yeah, I kind of like I don't know. I'm trying to think what I find sexy in a guy. Um, it's I, I, the thing is, my thing is, I if I was single, I pretty much fuck any guy who is yeah. who likes me. Yeah, <laughs> like any guy. Like I'm, I'm always like, um, I'm always like the kind of girl. If a guy is like, I really like you, I'm like, oh my god, I love that about you. No, Let's what? have sex. Okay, okay. What about this? Do you find guys with braces sexy? You know, no. Like, do okay, you? so that's one. No, no, no. Because that's like a pedophilia. No, thing, no, no. Okay, no, no. I'm just trying to figure out because I'm sure there's one thing that you look at and like I'd look at it but and be like, like yeah. ew, that's gross. Like physically. Mm. I mean, me, for example, um, what do I, I like? like? Solid guy. I oh, like solid guys. I like solid, solidly built guys. Okay. Uh, Damien the Loon, do you like guys with hairs on their shoulders, Cassie? I mean, sure. Really? Okay. Uh, AL, look sexy today. Who, who looks sexy? Tell <laughs> us. Tell us. The, the competition. Like, the big thing I find is that you like solid guys. I like big, mm. like a like bodybuilders. Yeah, very, very like muscle. bodybuilders. I don't like, like muscles, but I like huge. You know, like how Garen is solid. Like if you like push him, he's like a salt. Like it's not muscular. It's like a, I don't know how to explain it. It's tank. It's like I don't like like tank. He's, what? He's tank. Yeah, that's so what it's like called a, when they're not quite too muscly and they're not. But he's quite not muscle too fat. at all, but he's just very solid. He's got muscle underneath. Like he's got muscle and fat. It's like people that are. I like people that have no fat and they're just yeah. all muscle. No, but I just like I like somebody if I like push mm. that. So I don't like skinny guys. I'm not like a. Yeah. Um, both but, look sexy today. Ah, oh, thank you. But like a very unconventional thing that I like. Mm. Uh, let me have a think about it. I really like people who are very shy. I'm gonna be honest. I know that's not. It's not. I'm like, thinking about your last two boyfriends. Yeah, they were shy. Not. Zach not shy. Zach. Oh no, he was a massive. Talk. <laughs> we were talking about that. <laughs> what about you? Come on. You must have one thing that, like, one physical trait. Physical thing. I don't. But I don't have a type. Like, if you look, I've had three serious boyfriends. One has been French. One has been half Asian. Or one's been fully Asian. I can't think of anything. Between the three of them, except for the three of them are all obsessed. Oh yeah, I like eyebrows. You that's, like eyebrows. That's part of my body hair. Actually, yeah, you know what? And I like jaw lines. I need a big jaw. Like, like um, <laughs> you should match yours so you can yeah. bang them together. <laughs> when you've got a big jaw like this, you need something to be matching. You know, it's important. Very um, nice. But yeah, I was just thinking about it because you know they say that like there's always someone out there that can love you. Like there's always someone out there that'll find you attractive. And I was like, well, what about the people that have really hairy knuckles? Like, Which yours? I bet you've I've got, got hair. hair. I've got hairy knuckles. <laughs> See, <laughs> Perry's like hypothetically. Hypothetically, if you, if you had there's hairy. a wonderfully educated, pretty woman who's willing to love you, and she has hairy knuckles. Will you? They're not say that hairy. I've got blonde hairs on my knuckles. Oh, so if you've got hair on this little bit, you know the um. Uh, not your first knuckle, your second knuckle. That is a genetic trait, and it shows that you're more closely linked to. Uh, is it Homo erectus? Whatever. No, was... that Homo erectus is what we are. We're Homo erectus. Oh, okay. Yeah, homo tools. something. Yeah. Not. <laughs> so kind of the missing link, pretty much. No, the primate. Do you have hair there? I've got hair there. No. I'm closely linked. Yeah. There he is. <laughs> we were saying that earlier. You're pretty much in the answer. Can't help it. Yeah. Um, Unless very actively rhyme raises her own yeah. <laughs> This is, guys. This, this eyebrow thing that's going on is an active choice that I yeah. make because do you want to see my resting face? Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, my laugh is so annoying. Guys with a mullet. Oh, I actually don't mind guys with a mullet. I don't know it what it is. It depends how extreme the mullet is. I wouldn't okay. actively seek out. How about you. this long, like as in my hair and if we, if I was kind of like that. No. Oh no? my God, Perry, no. <laughs> Oh my god. No, I'm just asking. Oh I'm just it's just a question. Because you still need to hang on to you while you guys fuck. Oh no. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh. Why would I be Oh no, because he'd be bent over because he's a little yeah. bitch. Oh, okay. Fucking peg. Okay, now I've got it. But think about it, I reckon guys with massive beards is gonna become the mullet of the past. What do you think? You you think it's gonna grow out, guys? I, I cannot think... like I cannot even fucking kiss. Um, a beard? No. Like, I can't even kiss a guy with a beard. No, I fucking, actually, that's the thing. I fucking hate beards. You hate beards too? 
I, I like them aesthetically. Like, I like to look at a guy with a beard. I like the look of, you know, tattoos and you've got the rolled up sleeves. I think it's a Melbourne thing because they're yeah, always baristas. Like but I'd never. So I like there. hooked up with a guy with a mustache. And that oh, was, was it? Really mustache weird. ride. It was a mustache ride. Uh, it was really weird. Um, mm. And like, oh, uh, I'm just like, and Ali really likes guys. Ali, our other co host. If you guys don't fucking remember her, she hasn't been here for weeks. Um, it was really bitchy at Oh, first. Oh, young um, lady. Uh, Ali really likes guys with, with beard, beard and tattoos. That's hard thing. <coughs> but like, but like, I'm just like, I'm just imagining like food is caught in there. Oh, like in the twits, they all had food stuck in their beard. I know, but maybe that's why, because I read the twits yeah. a lot. No, as no, a that, kid. that scared me quite a bit. Um, one thing that I really don't like though is um, boys that gel their hair too much. Mm. I, I don't know. Garen spends forever on his hair. I don't get it. I've got some friends that are like, oh, that guy's really sexy. And his hair's like... Oh, I like when they've got like the greasy... Oh, yeah, I hate like, that look. Like, uh, oh, like no. I, it looks bad. It looks... I think... Oh, I know my thing. I like guys who are clean. Like, look clean. Oh, smell yeah. clean. Not, not, not... They don't look greasy. Yeah, they... I, I think it's my thing guys. about liking, liking nice guys. Right? Yeah. Like, because I like nice guys. I don't like guys who look like bad boys. Okay, so maybe that's why you don't like Captain Jack Sparrow. Because his big thing was he was well, yeah, kind of like... he looks fucking dirty. He was dirty. dirty and he had, like, makeup on underneath his eyes. And he was kind of like, you know, two tortuga and all that sort of thing. I want my man cleanly shaven. Uh, and I want him freshly bathed. She is an Orlando Because I will bloom. not suck your dick unless you have a fucking shower. Yeah, but they Unless look, I really like you. They look Or dirty. you really like me. <laughs> I mean... Because she's not picky at this point. <laughs> What about height, Cassie? Height. Um, I like the idea of a guy who's a lot taller than me. Yeah, I've only, it's not gonna happen because you're so tall. I know. I've only hooked up with one guy who was like a lot taller than me. He was like six foot eight. You are, and he like literally just threw me around. He was like, just like fucking. That's so. I felt people that big though. They tend to do that thing with their head where it's kind of like pushing forward because they're so used to talking to their little friends. They're like, oh hello. Well, this guy like picked me up. It was like such an alpha male move. He literally picked me up at a bar, and I was like, okay, you're mine. He literally, I was like walking to the bathroom in Zinc because there were some of my friends, and he just literally just like grabbed me and like pretty much slung me over his shoulder and it was like up though like a caveman oh actually, i found it really sexy you just reminded me when i was like 19 and i was I didn't even talk to him i remember his name doesn't matter Slutty. if you're watching hit us up yeah um when i was in Koh Samui and i was 19 there was a kid called alex M- mitchell no M- oh, M- M- any um, other? alex mikich mikich who apparently for a dare they were like go and pick up a girl physically and I was the chosen girl <laughs> and like apparently it was a really sexy thing to see because he came over and he picks me I was talking to someone he picks me up and he had me like this sideways like a plank and he did a push up with me and put me down and later I was talking to my friends and they were like oh my god it was so sexy <laughs> I ended up with fucking bruises <laughs> everywhere I had from like once in high school and I like, had sex with him <laughs> the pinch like yeah. I don't think he realised like in an effort to keep this body still and going forward he'd like Clawed like into my body. I'd it hurt. Smash. Why? That's oh, he does have. It's kind of sexy. Really? Yeah, it's kind of sexy. Wood mm. smash. Anyway, Alex Pickett, if you're watching, Cassie would smash. <laughs> I would smash. And um, which is awkward because yeah. we're friends. Yeah, and also just next time you pick up a girl like that, just be gentle because we've got delicate little ribs. That'd be okay. so fucking weird if he was watching. I wouldn't smash. Oh, she would. She would. <laughs> I would. Don't don't believe her. Let's face it. It's not Pretty much. much. Well, he ticks all the boxes. He had really big eyebrows. Um, He's mixed. Mixed. He was solid. Yeah. I think. Yeah, he was really muscly. Yeah. But so, oh, like muscly. he did acting. Oh, that's the one thing I fucking hate about guys. Anybody who does theatre or music. Oh, I have a story for after the break. Oh, okay, guys. Okay, okay, okay we're guys. We're gonna go to a break. break. Sorry, but we'll fill you in. Mwah, we love Bye. you. Hakaya 付費之後還可以重溫所有精彩的節目